Hello friends, it's Pastor Ricky here. I know you cannot see me, uh, but I am standing just in the foyer, uh, just as you come into the door, uh, into our sanctuary. And I wanted to give you a walkthrough of how we have the sanctuary set up uh, for Sunday and the procedures that we will follow uh, as we offer in-person worship. Uh, just a reminder, if you have not registered uh, to be in worship Sunday and you're intending to be here in person, please do so. Uh, you may go to our church website or you may go to our church app uh, and register. Uh, we need to know about how many people are going to be here so we will be properly prepared. And so I want to give you a walkthrough of what we have planned for Sunday, uh, people coming and people going for our worship services. Uh, we will have services at 9 and 1030. So you will walk in the door, you'll be greeted outside, the doors will be propped open. So as soon as you walk in the door into the foyer, uh, this is what you will see. Uh, there is a hand sanitizer station. Uh, there is also a supply of masks in case you forget yours, because we want everyone uh, to wear a mask while they're inside the building. And so you'll come in uh, after you have been greeted outside and after you uh, have visited the hand sanitizer station and you will walk into the sanctuary. You can see uh, in our sanctuary that, that we have the chairs set up. I'll tell you more about the way they're set up in just a moment. But as you walk in, uh, you will come right here first and you see these individual uh, prepared uh, communion elements. Uh, each one of these little packages has a wafer and juice in it. So you will come by and pick one up for yourself uh, or if you're collecting for your family, uh, the, the number that's needed for your family. And we also have gluten-free available if you need that as well. And of course, look, hand sanitizer. And so you will pick up the communion elements and take them with you and then go to your seat. Uh, if you'll notice these chairs, uh, we, have, we have chairs that are, that are turned inward. Uh, that's because every other row in the sanctuary is blocked off. Uh, with our two worship services, 9 o'clock service, we'll use rows 1, 3, 5, and 7. And the 1030 service, then we will switch the chairs around and, and block off uh, block off the, the rows that were used at, at 9 o'clock and open up the rows so that, that, that will be used at 10 o'clock and so the uh, at 1030. So the 1030 service will use rows 2, 4, 6, 8. So uh, we will only use every row one time on Sunday morning. Uh, and so I wanted to show you this. Uh, this is the, the AV setup. This is where the magic happens for our live stream every Sunday morning at 1030. Uh, a lot of work goes into that. And so God bless all of our AV team uh, and the wonderful job they have been doing for us. Uh, and so we will meet and we will worship the Lord together. And we will celebrate communion together. And we will praise God for all of God's blessings in our life together. Uh, and, you know, I, I cannot stress enough uh, that, that if you're uncomfortable uh, being here, join us online for worship at 1030. Uh, and we will be blessed together that way as well. And so after worship, uh, just as we had one way in, there will be one way out. And so as, as you depart the sanctuary, uh, we will go out a different door. Uh, you'll notice that on your right as you leave, look, there is an offering box. And look, more hand sanitizer. Uh, you may leave your offering in the box. There's actually three other boxes on your way out as well. Uh, there, there is receptacles here for your used communion uh, cups, and so please uh, bring them with you and, and deposit them in one of these two trash cans. You'll exit the sanctuary back into the foyer. Here, see, we have these chairs kind of blocked off because we want everybody uh, be coming in uh, up on the west door and everybody leaving with the north door. And so as you leave, uh, you will notice uh, more offering boxes and more hand sanitizer stations as you leave. and then you will exit out of the north doors of the foyer. Uh, we request that, that no one uh, hang out in the foyer, but to visit with your friends and neighbors, please uh, exit the building 
and go and, and enjoy the wonderful shade underneath our beautiful trees uh, to, to connect uh, with, with your neighbors who you may not have seen uh, for several months. So that is our plan that we currently have in place. Uh, I ask your continued prayers uh, for, for our reopening task force uh, and for the continued ministry of Spring Creek United Methodist Church. Uh, God bless you, and I look forward to seeing you soon. Bye-bye.